Pope Francis today issued a new church law to address the clergy sex abuse scandal that has rocked the Catholic Church. Seth Doan on what it does and doesn't require. Pope Francis's sweeping new law makes it mandatory for priests and nuns to report sexual abuse and its cover-up. The decree sets out procedures and timelines for investigations, including those against bishops, and requires every diocese in the world to establish an office to deal with abuse allegations. It mandates dioceses develop simple ways for victims to report, seeks to protect whistleblowers, and puts the onus on the Vatican to respond quickly. It is a very strong message that it, disclosure is the order of the day and not silence. The new law does not mandate reporting to police or prosecutors, though it does say local churches must adhere to the reporting laws in their countries. There are loopholes. Abuse revealed during confession, for instance, would remain secret. The church is incapable of policing itself. Sean Doherty is a survivor whom CBS News has followed for months. I know in the eyes of the world, this is a very big step. However, this is in our opinion, the church ordering the church to report to the church. Pope Francis's decree will be used as a framework for U.S. bishops to establish their own measures when they meet next month. While welcoming the tightening of procedures, survivors have been critical that this does not mandate transparency to the public. It also does not address penalties, Jeff, such as the defrocking of convicted priests. All right, Seth Doan, thank you.